Yeah, I was slated for one role, but I think there was an urgency to fill that role. And so now, once my deal closes, there's been a discussion about a few other roles. I honestly don't know what the role will be, but hopefully it'll be something where I can make a meaningful impact. Uh, he's one of the smartest people that I've ever met. He's one of the most intuitive people that I've ever met. He's a very compassionate guy. He said to me, listen, I'm running for president. You're halfway decent on TV. I don't need any money. I'd like you to join my campaign. I'd like you to help me. We'll go around the country uh, and we'll tell this story about how we're going to fix America and make America great again. And I said, well, first of all, you're not going to run for president. Uh, I don't believe you. I said, moreover, I've been in your apartment. It's four times the size of the White House residence. Uh, I've been on your plane. Your plane is unbelievable. You don't have to carry the press around in the plane. Uh, once I declare myself the candidate, we're going to start winning, and then, you know, we're going to win until you guys get tired of winning. When Mr. Trump won, now President Trump, and he was putting his executive team together, he said, look, I want you on the team. Reasonably good eye for hiring. You've built two reasonably successful organizations. Help me hire the team. I said, okay. And I think that he's done an unbelievable job. This is my personal opinion, and maybe I'm biased because I was on his executive transition uh, team, uh, of staffing the cabinet. I think that these cabinet members, uh, whether it's uh, General Mattis, I mean, I can name them all, Stephen Mnuchin, Rex, uh, Secretary of State Tillerson, these are very accomplished people. I, I believe they are, and I know some of them personally. In the last 15 months, uh, my observation is he really wants to do the right thing. I think the president, and if you just look at the stock market and asset prices since his inauguration, uh, there's a sense of confidence. I think people view the president as a pro-business president. I love the president. I've studied the stuff very carefully. And, uh, you know, I feel like we have a historic opportunity.